All right, Hades versus another, I mean, what? Athena versus another Hades main. Normally, the go-to Hades main I always see is Dazmad22. If any of you guys have been chilling in Plath for as long as I have, meaning the entire fucking split, you probably fought against that dude. Me and him got beef. No, nah, <laughs> we don't get real beef, but. That's what I'm just used to seeing is him and his fucking Hades. Not gonna lie, I don't want to get too close to that because of uh, explosion damage. Even though that would take up his clear, so actually that wouldn't be too bad. But yeah, we see you got his, uh, he got his Bancroft's Talon. Hopefully that means we can get the, uh, oh, uh, a red buff. Jesus. Uh, this is the thing about Hades, is his fucking early game. I just got done fighting against his Nami, and I feel like I'm just doing the same thing over again. With the, uh, the whole insane early game clear and damage. Here's the thing. Both have, uh, yeah, Hades is kind of like the mage as an army. Like, what is that? But yeah, I got beats here just because as Athena, I like to use my one to initiate a lot, and he's going to capitalize off of that. Oh, see, kind of like that. So I kind of have to, like, go out of here and use my beats. If I didn't buy beats, that was probably that. I could have gone shell and lived. Um, but yeah, just use the beats for the ultimate for the extra security. Also, the beast does come in clutch when fighting Hades, and you're about to kill him, and he's like silences you or fears you, and you can just break out of it. Because late game, that fear and silence that lasts for a very long time, and can really screw you over. And the beast just helps so much. So he did end up getting red buff, and he got my beads. So not a good look for me, so far. But this, the later this game goes, the better it will be for Athena. So we just gotta just last out. This is on PS4 too? Yeah, the restricted camera pitch? Yeah, must be like all platform thing where it just always starts you off like... <laughs> like that. Okay, at least we have the blue buff. That's the thing about fighting Hades is he can often just overwhelm you with taking all your buffs really quickly. Quicker than his Anami. Alright, let's um... Let's snap back here because the wave's coming up. And if I back now, he's gonna like instantly clear this and get tower shots. But if you're like me and you're you know, playing duel and you're really an aggressive player early game and you fight people or gods like this, you kind of just want to like, just uh, you kind of just suck it up, man, and just kind of just play defensive. There's only so much you can do. That's where like, I don't know, the god picks really influence your game. So you can't always like feel bad for you know, falling behind like I am here. 300 gold. He's gonna do blue buff, and yeah. Let's fight from behind, man. Let's camp out your poke. Yeah, because he can full heal. Yeah. I don't want to dash in quite yet. I want to save that. So I think he has enough mana ult. Look how, like, huge Hades ult. That ult. His fucking auto attacks. Look. I feel like this just gives him an advantage. So Athena could do like good early game damage, kind of like it's very similar to the last matchup I just had. He, he's looking at me like, bitch I dare you. We're gonna go at it from like an angle there. I was hoping to get hit by a uh, tower show. I'm gonna put two points into my two. Let's keep it at that. So we kind of have to go into Pestilence. We're always gonna be around his face and in range for the uh, Pestilence. So we're just gonna go into that. What the fuck, Dev? Justice will always prevail. Wait, does Athena say that? Just saw the RDO shot game. He just surrendered like, no way I'm gonna win this. Yeah. And that's the thing, like I just had the um, Ymir versus uh, Izanami. Oh. Can I live in this? Yeah, no, we're chilling. That's a big thing, is just like testing your luck against early game Hades ult, and like, yo, can I live? 
and we're able to pull it off. If I can keep the beads, uh, we're, we're still safe. Uh, but yeah, no, back to what I was saying about the Ymir versus Athena. I mean, what the fuck? I am like so messed up on my names today. But Ymir versus Izanami. It's just like that shock game. They just, uh... Didn't, didn't let it keep going. I don't want to spoil it, actually, now that I think about it. <laughs> anyway. Back to the game. Get this blue buff. We just like, kind of go through the, through the motions. After playing Duel for a while, you just kind of have the, the whole motions feel. It's kind of like if, you know, you're still in school, you go through the motions. Of the, of just throughout the entire day. Classroom, classroom, homeroom. Whatever. That's what they do now. Once we get our Divine Rune after our Upshard, I think we're gonna have some killing potential on him. Yeah, what's up, Tech? It's one of the downsides just playing against Hades. I'm lucky I'm Athena, actually. Yo, he, he just he just gotta he gave me the clap. You just gotta do it on him, man. You just gotta just do it on him, man. That, that's just what you gotta do, man. You gotta you gotta show him your your fucking juke shoes, man. Oh my god, absorb stacks. Oh my god. Oof. I see why you're playing Hades and not a hunter, my man. I see you. What'll it be? Oh my. Oof. Alright, we're gonna hit him so we can bring all these minions together. <laughs> He's definitely not an ADC main, I'll tell you that much. This is a Hades main? Yeah. He has a lot of Hades games. Alright, we're gonna try out our damage here. Surprised he didn't try it for an ult. Do I need a beads? No. Nah. You just gotta have like the balls of steel, man. Oh. Oh, full fucking heal. Alright. Well. At least we're looking pretty alright here. Looking better. Go into our pestilence. We're gonna go into uh, pin item. Yeah, I was gonna say if he wasn't going defense here, I would actually go into divine first. Uh, but he is going defense here. But yeah, once we get the ob shard, we have to like punch through this Genji's guard, and then you know he also has the extra defense when he ults. So if you want to fight back into that, we're gonna need this ob shard. Of course, the red's not up. So we're just going to the back here. I think Garden Season Five would be great in duel. Due to power, powerful mage items, although one or two, this pen items are scary. Yeah, um, I don't know what I want to go here. I might just go into show. But yeah, you know, um, that's the thing, is that there's the new pen items. Well, I mean, they're the same items, just they got buffed up. Buffed up pen items, they're scaling, and also the anti health items, also got those. So it's like, yeah, guardians have stronger items and then you also got stronger anti just tank items oh, okay our clear is looking good wow all right yeah oh he tried doing i was gonna say he should try doing that ducking through my um uh, my taunt just avoid it. How much is Opture? 15? You think I remember this, but I, I just don't. <laughs> he just walked into the secondary damage. Uh, Alright, well, we gotta go ahead and leave. Yo, what up, Leanne? Or Lean? I feel like calling someone Lean is just weird. 
I feel like that's a fucking a mumble rapper's name. So let me not call you lean. I'll, I'll find find something for you. But welcome to the, to the stream. Oh, he's pissed. You don't like that. <laughs> Little lean, yo. <laughs> Hell yeah, young lean. Yeah. All right, one more item. I'm gonna kind of fight into him. I always just like how he just gives up auto attacking me after a little bit. All right, maybe his blues up. Nope. Something you kind of have to do in matchups like these, where it's just kind of the resident sleeper. Uh, Cause he could certainly kill me if I'm not too careful, but I can't really kill him unless if I get the anti heal locked down, and then we can fight into him and whatnot. And guardians, they just kind of scale really well in the late game for their damage. Be looking for a bit, alright, tech, no problem. Yeah, I heard you down that. But yeah, it's gonna go from like no kills to being a pretty back and forth fight. The hardest part about this matchup is for the late game, when I can actually kill him and him just diving through towers or what the fuck through walls and shit like that. I see, so you can start taking his damage now. Thing is, you have to make sure you don't stand near your minion wave because you'll take additional damage if he blights. If he does that and you're in that minion wave, you will get hit so hard. So you gotta make sure that doesn't happen to you. Let's see, we're looking better here. We just need that Divine Ruin. This matchup is so relaxing. I, like, to watch or to play? <laughs> Alright, welcome back, Bills. What's up, Juggernaut? When you hear Laney, think of meat. Alright. No. Woo! Oh, dude, I thought, he, I thought he was actually just like stuck the lane. He's gonna just sit up there. That'd be cool. Yeah, there's just not really much to do in the, in a matchup like this. Until the late. You just kind of just farm just back and forth. So why wow, I was just trying to chill right now and this is helping. Hey, I'm glad. But, you know, in this matchup, like, if you're fighting Hades and you're someone that can actually do BDK, you know, you might look to even try to steal BDK uh, when the Hades backs or something like this. Being a fiend, there's just no way I can do BDK at this point. I don't think so. Not in a timely fashion, at least. Yeah, look at that damage. Did not want to get hit with that bonus damage. No. Um, I think we're alright. We're gonna shell just in case. Cause I wasn't sure when his three was back up, and I was kind of worried that was gonna blow me up. That's just how many fucks Hades gives about uh, anything in life. <laughs> he just went through the tower and just like life sealed off of it. I'm kind of worried about Hades and that new life steal item um, in season five PTS. You know, m immediately Anubis comes to mind, but don't forget about Hades and his healing. And his lifesteal potential, it's just... <sighs> I, I don't know. If this does go end up going to YouTube, uh, it might not. If this match is the entirety of it is just this, then I probably wouldn't post it regardless if I win or lose. Uh, I'm hoping for it to spike up and be hyped somewhat soon. Um, but yeah, as soon as I can do Season 5, like, custom duels, then look forward to that. He's probably just gonna just dash out. Nope. It's actually pretty good. Do some good damage here. Yeah, look at- alright, we're doing good. We kind of forced him to miss majority of the wave to the tower, so he loses out on the gold. Maybe a little bit of XP, and of course takes tower damage. Now the next step, this can- uh, our next step is can actually uh, speed up this game, and that's going to poly. Oh, that's just- 
What the f- okay. So any of you guys that play on my Tarasu a lot or Athena and you didn't try to dash past someone and just like just you just get stuck on someone else. Horrible feeling. Oh there we go. You gotta look for some cute ass shit like that, man. He just got too impatient real quick. But like I was trying to say about our next step, our next item is gonna we're gonna go to a poly and as always if you see me upload videos with Athena. The poly and the reach is just really, really good. Speeds up matches. Um, especially those that are really just passive. Because we can just like long range poke the tower in Phoenix with safety and do good damage with it too. It's like clinch. Don't lie, all of you guys fucking do clinch really hard. <laughs> It was an all-in play. Honestly, I, didn't, I I wasn't sure if I was going to live. I thought some bullshit was going to happen, and then like he was going to break out my tongue quick enough, kill me and lifesteal and run away. But yeah. We were able to get the first blood in the tower. Like I said earlier, this is when things speed up, is when I get that Divine Ruin and can kill him. Next, we're going to get Polly. And progress. It kind of sucks. There's like a 15-minute you know, wind-up time to this like matchup. Not much I could have really done. I mean, I could have played really aggressive early on, but it would have, it would have meant that I was gonna like die and shit. All right, he misses three. All he has left is his dash. Dash. What the fuck? I can't just fucking talk today. Hades has some long cooldowns. There we go. Uh, there, <laughs> I don't know why he decided to, um, I guess what he thought was that, okay, Athena has her dash, so wherever I dash, she's gonna be able to follow me, so instead, let's just try to kill her, and that boy was not the case. Okay, so you're gonna see about this Athena poly in a second here, so you can just do this, poly shot it, I probably don't hit too hard right now until we get to Huidi, but yeah. Yo, what's up, Minthos? Welcome to the stream. Oh, fuck. Red buff is up. Let me go ahead and... At least down. I can't pick it up, but I'll get it down. I don't want him to have it. Looks like his... He's trying to go into that 2v2. We gotta do this and run. Actually, we don't need to totally run. I can go ahead and try to clear this. Kind of want to just like reach hit that. Okay, so you try jumping over, or not jump over the wall, but look at the wall and see if my blue. But anyway, what's up? <laughs> it's not. Let's go ahead and get this. We gotta run. Hey, guard games, are you winning, man? Um, I've won almost 300. The split alone. I don't know. Tower hit? Tower? Hey! Alright. We gotta be careful here. We need to apply Divine Rune. Alright, we got the Divine. Okay. How to pop that shell? I need to live here. You kinda have to, like, just give that up, unfortunately. You're not always gonna be able to defend your tower, you just gotta accept the loss there. We're gonna get a couple wards. Now that my tower's down, we just gotta look out for BDK. But yeah, my win rate for a Guardian Duel for a uh, Fall Split is maybe like 55% or something like that. Okay, well, let's go ahead and get this. Slow with Athena's damage? Yeah, no, that's really good. That's a lot of damage. When you see damage like that, you, you really think about going double defense, but. Oh. Fuck. 
I started the channel and the thing about Athena's one, it's uh for one, it's a long channel, and two, it's also lengthy to cancel the channel. And three, you cannot use any relics when channeling it. So like I try to see if I can dash out in time, realize I couldn't, and then by the time I can try to cancel it in the pop beats, I was just too dead. Too dead, too late. But yeah, no, that is the the risk you, you run of doing just a single defense against Hades, is he can still blow you up pretty quickly. So then it just becomes the matchup of just like who can blow up the other person the quickest. Lost my Phoenix. Another thing when you fight Hades, you have to keep um, having Divine Ruin proc'd on him. Because if you don't and he gets to just like heal, like out of combat, he just heals off your wave or heal off your blue or whatever. It's just not a good look when you're trying to I mean, it's a long lasting match. Okay. Well, doesn't look like you can pick it up, so that's good. This stain is just insane, yeah. He's also a very simple character to use and be effective with. Um I feel like we kinda have to just chill out for a while. Oh, hello friend. I try to go for like one of these. There we go. I mean that time it worked. But the last time he still like caught me. Alright, that somehow didn't hit him. But yeah, I was kinda just play passive until this Phoenix comes up and make another play out that. Yeah. Ideally you should probably, I don't know, go double defense, like not go the poly and then go into like voice or something like that. But it sucks giving a poly on Athena because of her uh, her reach. It's just so good. Alright, again, you don't want to stand near your wave. You will fuck your day up. Alright. Well, his dash is down. Maybe we could just do that. Maybe we could just, like, keep... Okay. Fucking fierce ridiculous. Nice. He tried to get me with that. Keep poking this man. Ooh! Alright, you felt that poly, boy. You felt that shit. Alright, now this is where shit gets scary. Because he might be able to, like, all in the time, so we gotta just really poke this man out. We still got shell, he got his shell, he got his beads. That's a Scorpio. Still got fucking minions chasing me. The Phoenix is almost up. Just gonna make sure he doesn't down in course. But he's really squishy and I'm really squishy. Alright, good. I'm glad he's not pressuring with the wave. Instead, he's just doing camps. Alright, don't even ask me how he missed that. When I was recalling perfectly still, but this is good. Phoenix to back up. Titan's gonna start healing. However, he does have another fire wave, I'm pretty sure. I think he did all of his shit there. Getting these reach hits. That's what we need, man. Phoenix should be alright. I'm worried about how much healing is gonna. Oof, yep. Back pedal. <laughs> that was a mean ass back pedal. All right, I got a full wave here. Got to keep this shit going. He just threw a lot there. He really wanted to get that Phoenix down. All right, with the power of Polis, charge this up and get the Poly hit here. 
Alright. Ah, uh, I don't think all that was worth it for this poly hit, but yeah. We got the Phoenix. He just threw that Phoenix so hard. Thought he was out. Same. Alright, we're gonna upgrade this. I guess buy a couple wars. And here we go. Ah. <sighs> Managed to get an assist and duel. Oh, I did get the assist. I didn't think I was in assist range. I mean, it's not my first time getting an assist and duel. But like, yeah. Doesn't happen too often. Fuck. Look at that damage. You see how fucking insane that damage was? Alright, oh, he's looking to heal off my blue. It gives us time to just clear the wave and peace out. Oh, he's gonna- is he- really? Okay! Useless motherfucking Phoenix, back at it again. He's like full healed off that shit too. Word! I guess I should've just stayed at Phoenix, but I would've ran the risk of dying. Oh well. Quinn, what's up dude? Yeah, sometimes I feel like Phoenixes are just useless in duel. <laughs> Whatever. Now it's five minutes for five minutes, but I don't know, man. Oh, please. No. Yo, actually, I'm not sure when it shits up. Exactly. Are you fucking- okay. I even- I even pre beast the silence, but yeah. Uh, we might have to do double defense here, boys. We're getting blown up to fucking blitz. Just fucking- Yeah. Um, that sucks. That means none of that. We have to go void stone, boys. So close. Yeah, we might actually lose the entire game off of that. The power of Hades. Back at it again, man. Man, we played that so well too. Oh yeah, no, that's that's up. That's crazy. Yeah, it sucks, dude. There's the game. Like I always say, like if you Hades is just such a good and simple, easy to use mage, and he pulls off some insane damage and sustain. Uh, I think the next time I do this match, I'm just going to try the double defense right off the bat. It just sucks. Uh, no poly Athena. It just it just really feels bad, man. But yeah, it. One of those things that hits you right in the feels. Right in the feels. I lost all my TP. Okay. Goodbye, TP. Yeah, GG. Uh, we tried. Feels bad, man. 